What's up, my friends? So I want to do something a little different today than the normal vlogs. Oh, this thing keeps falling on me. Okay. I want to do something a little different today. Um, I wanted to show you the results of the 100 push-up challenge that I did for 30 days. Uh, that video is one of my most popular videos, so I thought I would update you guys and show you some of the results. Um, what I can say, you know, is I've been doing push-ups for a long time, and the only thing is, you know, I won't have, you know, my results won't show as much than someone who just started working out or just started doing the challenge would. I mean, a newbie always gets more results than someone who's been training for a little while. I'm not saying, you know, I'm serious about training it, but push-ups have been my main go-to workout for a number of years. Therefore, this challenge, you know, isn't going to significantly have uh, show changes for me. Um, so what I did, you know, every day I would pretty much do 100 push-ups for 30 days. Nothing really to it. I changed the variations from close grip, regular grip, to wide grip, and that was pretty much it. I mean, I can tell you guys seriously. I, there's days I skipped. There's days I did 60 or 80. I didn't. I lost track sometimes. But the main thing was to do them all at once, not just like you know 10 in the morning, 20 at 11, or you know 30 here and there. Just try to do them all at once, all in one sitting type thing. Now it's not all in one like one hundred, like a hundred rep set, but all in one you know space of time. Um, yeah, it was it, it was a pain in the ass. I can tell you that truthfully. Um, just you know, but I don't regret it for a second because now you know going to the gym three times a week doesn't seem as bad. That's why I encourage people who are just starting to work out. To start something like this, if you can commit to this for 30 days, going to the gym for three days a week will not seem that bad. Um, these are my results. I'll put them up right here. So you can tell there's a little bit of difference, a little bit more toning. I lost the tan on the on the one uh, on the after picture, and just a little bit more toning. You're not going to see crazy results. Um, if you've been working out for a while, that's for sure. You will build your endurance for push-ups, that's for sure as well. But um, as far as you know, getting bigger and getting really toned from just push-ups, you know, you really have to be a new, a newbie to working out and to push-ups. Uh, one more thing, I'll tell you right now, it was a pain in the ass because you know you come home from work and uh, nobody wants to just sit there and do 100 push-ups while they're you know while they're trying to cook dinner or while they're trying to watch a show but the best thing i can recommend is during commercials to a show or after you're watching a video on youtube do 20. watch another video do 20. because you know it's just that's the best way of getting it done so a couple things i can recommend for this challenge make sure you stretch and warm up um, that's very important for this and another thing is do them during commercials of your shows or after you watch an episode of a show. You can do, you know, watch an episode of whatever it may be that you're watching and do 20. Watch an episode, do 20. Or watch a YouTube video, do 20. Because we know you come home from work, you come home from school, and you're tired, whatever. You're just going to start using your phone or start watching Netflix. You want to do them in segments during that time. That's the way you get done 100 easily. If you just say, okay, I'm going to do 100 right now. You'll probably do 40 and then stop and go do something else and never come back to it. So I'd say break it up like that. A show, 20. A show, 20. Or, you know, your show, commercials, 20. Commercials, 20. Type of thing like that. That's the best way I can recommend doing that. Um, other than that... Have you ever felt... Are you listening? Damn. Will I do the challenge again? I've been asked. Probably not. I'll end up doing you know something I haven't worked out much before. You know maybe a hundred, a uh, hundred crunches a day challenge for thirty days. That's something. Not doesn't seem too difficult. It might have to be a little more because crunches are easier than push-ups, to me anyways. Um, other than that. challenge you guys to do this if you are starting to work out or if you just want to improve you know um, 
you know, your chest and your triceps and your shoulders as well, actually, because it is a challenge. I mean, it doesn't seem like much, but committing to something for every single day for 30 days and doing a hundred of it, it will challenge you and you'll, it will challenge you mentally because you'll know you have to do it every single day. And if you skip it, you'll end up feeling like crap. Um, what else can I tell you guys? Other than that, I just want to say, you know, this challenge, yeah, it's a pain in the ass. So I know I took a long time to make this video and I know that uh, it's a little bit overdue but in the end procrastination got the best of me with this video. I was focused on other projects. That's not an excuse, you know. Procrastination will kill you. It's just something that everybody faces. Everyone has something they're trying to do and they just keep pushing back whether it's working out or making videos, starting a channel. Um, it's always I'll start tomorrow, I'll start tomorrow or you know. I'll start when I have X, Y, and Z. You can't wait for the perfect time. The perfect time will never come. You truly have to make it your time to do it today. And I know it all sounds cliche and I'm just rambling on, but that's truly how I feel. Even, for example, this video, it's about two weeks old, I'm getting it done, and there's gonna be true beauty in completing something. Every time I hit that big upload button, you know, I feel a sense of satisfaction. I'm done with it and, you know, it's out on YouTube, the world can see it, and that's all that really matters, you know, after that. I, whatever I make, uh, whatever I edit, it doesn't matter anymore, it's finished. So all I can tell you from this video, guys, if you want to challenge yourself, start with something like this. It will be a challenge, but it will be worth it. No matter your physical results, mentally you will get stronger with this challenge. And I'm not trying to hype it up to be more than what it is. It's just truly a challenge, and you will benefit from it. That's it. So with that being said, guys, if you like this video, please hit like down below, subscribe. We'll do many more challenges together and we'll continue this journey. All right. Thank you.